Today, we're going to cover something that I get asked a lot while playing Pokemon Pocket on my live stream. Jeff, how do you play Pokemon Pocket on PC? Today, we are going to walk through a tutorial on installing that with LD Player. Shout out to them for not only sponsoring today's video, but finally giving me the kick in the pants that I needed to get Pokemon Pocket set up on my own PC. I've been playing a lot of hours hunched over my cell phone, and my neck's been getting a little bit of a creak in it from doing so, so it'll be nice when I'm having a nice long pocket play session to be able to look up at my monitor with proper posture moving forward. Getting everything set up is super straightforward. You can just go to ldplayer.net or click the link in the video description down below. Front and center on their website, there is Pokemon TCG Pocket Play on PC. You give that a link and they've got a fully branded installer ready to not only get LD Player set up on your computer but have Pokemon Pocket installed on it by default. One thing that's worth noting is that once you get everything set up and installed, you want to be watching the notifications that are coming up the first time you're launching LD Player. On my personal computer, the first time I launched it, I needed to restart my system with a setting that it wanted to configure to allow the Android virtual machine that it's running Pokemon Pocket through to run more smoothly. Once I had this set up, Pokemon Pocket popped right up and let me log in. In, I went ahead and linked up my Nintendo account that's linked to my account and this transferred my save data from my mobile device so I'm now easily able to have all of my same Pokemon Pocket stuff on my PC through LD Player just like I have when I'm playing on my mobile phone. Honestly super impressed with how clean and easy getting Pokemon Pocket on LD Player set up was. I had tried it at the game's launch on other Android emulators that I had tried in the past they all just kept crashing out of me so it was a breath of fresh air to fire this one up and just have everything work from opening booster packs to even going through and playing the fancy movies in the immersive cards and of course playing a ton of different games ld player has been clean and smooth in my experience and i expect moving forward you'll be able to see me using it in a lot of my content here on the channel since it's incredibly more convenient to be able to play pocket on my computer for a long session than it is to be playing it directly on my phone as one final setup tip that can make your Pokemon Pocket experience on PC a little bit better, if you go into the display settings for LD Player, you can set the resolution to a custom one that's a little bit more square. This forces Pokemon Pocket to utilize more of your screen real estate as a vertical game. Personally, I set my width to 2176 with the height by 1812 with the DPI at 373. This matches the display resolution resolution on my Android foldable device that I know Pokemon Pocket displays on very well. As you can see here, once we have this setting toggled, the amount of space that Pocket takes up inside of the L LD player from left to right feels much better and is a lot less cramped than the default thin vertical one that you're going to get like on a lot of cell phones. Shout out to LD Player again for sponsoring today's video and giving me a fantastic way to play Pokemon Pocket on the PC in an incredibly convenient manner. If you want to set that up for yourself, again, ldplayer.net or check the link in the video description down below. I'll go ahead and let you see how this game plays out though, because I'm sure some of you are wondering about that. We'll see you back here again real soon for some more excellent Pokemon Pocket content now being played on my PC.